It's an emotional day here in Brussels after a moment of silence to commemorate the victims of Tuesday's bombings. Many families here in Brussels are still searching for missing loved ones. I don't have the words to express what I feel, but it's true that we have been used to seeing these attacks for a long time. But when it happens at home, you feel it in a stronger way. You feel more involved. It's the least we could do for the victims. Like the Paris attacks in November, Islamic State militants claimed responsibility for the bombings, which came four days after Salah Abdul Salam, one of the men accused of the Paris attacks, was arrested in Brussels. Belgian prosecutor Frederick Van Loo said police found a will on a computer left behind by one of the bombers. Dans une poubelle de la même rue, in a bin in the same street, the investigators found a computer containing the will of Ibrahim El Bakrawi, in which he says he was in a rush. I don't know what to do, hunted everywhere, no longer safe, and that if he waits around too long, he risked ending up in a cell next to him. Much of the city remains on lockdown as authorities continue the search for a third suspected bomber. The airport will be closed at least through Thursday. Heather Murdoch, VOA News, Brussels.